Hi, beloved. You know what? My name is A. Milady. This is Heavenly Host Vision with Lady. I'm so glad to welcome you to yet another prophetic word. May the Almighty God bless you and keep you safe, sound, and protected. Someone has been going places. Someone has been going the extra miles, going to dark places over your head because you refuse to be at your beck and call. You refuse to submit to somebody that they thought that they were of high authority. They thought that they had people at their beck and call. Someone who thought that no one could ever turn them down. Someone like you bruise someone's ego and they are not happy about it. Whose ego did you bruise like that? Whose ego did you bruise like that? They are not happy with you at all. Because if they thought that you'd be at their, at their beck and call, you'd be crawling, you know, calling them, trying to have an appointment with them, trying to, to you know, to, to identify with them. Like, if someone thought that you'd be struggling so hard to identify with them, but you're not doing it. You, you're not doing it. You're not calling. You're not doing anything. You know to get yourself yoked together with them and they're not happy they're like who they're asking themselves who are you why why are you behaving like this so strange so funny because they feel that because they've got enough you know they feel that because they have their they are wealthy perhaps they they they, they are of high standards they are people of caliber and everything but you don't really give you, you don't you don't you don't you, 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 you don't give livers to those things you do not give livers to what to whomever they are, whatever they possess, and it's like they're, they're not happy about it. And they're like, You, why you that you're not up to their standard, you're, you're distancing yourself from them? Someone is mad, someone is mad that you are not bowing down to them. Yes. Now you're not bowing down to them. Just like how money can't not bow down to him, man. It's, it's, not, it's something like that. So, like, they're, like, thinking, looking at you, like, because they, what, what your, rea your actions towards them is, like, kind of surprising. They're not because they are everything. You come crawling, come begging, everything. Like, why? Why? Why should you? And because of that, they are so mad. They are not happy. They are not happy and they're going, they're going to places to try to set you up. Be very careful, beloved. It's set up. Be careful. They, they think that they could, they, they could implicate you, but they can't, they can't do that. It's, they have been arrested in the spirit. Some, some, someone has been arrested in the spirit and they can't do anything to implicate you. You have nothing to hide. You have nothing to prove. You have no, you, you, they don't deserve, they don't, if, if they could go that mile to do your harm because you refused to bow up to them, they were not, means they were not good in the first place and your intuition, your discernment was, was correct. Your discernment was right about somebody. Your discernment was right about somebody and you didn't hesitate to, to just take your attention away from them and they are getting so mad because they are, they are, they are their egos have been bruised. Numbers 23 verse 23, it says, There is no divination against Jacob, nor evil omen against Israel. It will now be said to Jacob and to Israel, See what the Lord has done. No, no, no spell, divination, enchantment, whatever that they went to do to submit you, to humble you, shall work in your life. It's like they wanted to, to humble you by doing certain things to break you. You shall not be humbled by anyone. You are very much intact. And you are very much sane. You are with your full mind. Nothing lovers shall bring you down. They have been arrested in the spirit. Someone has been arrested in the spirit. And whatever that they have been trying to do to humble you shall not prevail. It shall not prevail. Whatever acts have been planned against your life because you decided to, to stay on your own. You decided to like say, no, you, 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 you can't identify yourself. Whatever that you're trying to do, that is going to be just in vain. Glory be to God. In vain. In vain. It's not, it's not an, an, an authority in your nation or whatever, but for some reason you, you, you perceive that someone wasn't approaching you the way, in the right way, and you decide to resist them. And it's not sitting well. It is not sitting well. Be protected. Be protected in the name of our Savior Christ Jesus. No weapon that is formed against you shall prosper. And any tongue that, tongue that rises up against you in judgment shall be condemned. It shall be condemned. For this is your heritage in the Lord. And, the, and, and vindication is your portion in Jesus' mighty name. God bless you. 
and see you in the next video.